Welcome everyone to the Shen Champion Spotlight, presented by Riot Games. I'm Freak, and I'll show you how I play Shen. There are other playstyles, but this video details mine. Shen is a ninja, adept at darting in and out of battles and distracting enemies. As a ninja, Shen follows three basic rules. 1. Shen is a mammal. 2. Shen fights all the time. 3. The purpose of Shen is to flip out and kill people. Over the course of this video, I will show you how to play a tank Shen. I try to build him with a lot of hit points, maxing out the damage output of his key strike passive, and making the most of Shadow Dash's taunt. There are a couple of ways you can go with your runes. I'm using flat hit points on marks, hit points per level on seals, flat cooldown reduction on glyphs, and flat hit points again on quintessences. You could easily change seals to armor or dodge, glyphs to magic resist, marks to cooldowns or any other defensive stat, but because Shen only has one direct damage ability, I don't really recommend magic penetration. For masteries, I always like to run 21 points in defense on all melee champions, which lets me run into battles very early and stay alive through them. I splash 9 points into offense so that I can get improved exhaust, cooldown reduction, and a little bit of increased damage to minions. Vorpal Blade is an amazing laning tool. I regenerate massive amounts of health from tagging a minion and swinging at it a few times, so it's good to fight all the time, as long as you're careful. However, I overextend, and Poppy comes swinging for me. As soon as I can, I start running down, and once I cross my minion wave, I use Shadow Dash, taunting her and running through my minions. Once she gets low, I toss a Vorpal Blade, flip out, and kill her. I Shadow Dash onto Cassidin to try to pick him off with our Heimerdinger, but unfortunately we don't quite have enough damage to kill him. Suddenly, Anivia and Ezreal show up and I have to make my escape. I try to stand united with our Cardmaster, but he gates out right as I try to click on him. Instinctively, I exhaust Ezreal and then find Needly to land my teleport. Notice how the shield breaks and my health starts dropping right as I teleport out. The ultimate is a great escaping tool, but it comes at the price of a very long cooldown. I meet up with my team near the dragon. I shadow dash forward to try to pick off Poppy, but Ghost gets her out of harm's way. Evelyn has been taunted though, so she becomes an easy kill as she blindly follows me around. Ezreal tries to mess with us, but Shadow Dash turns him into an easy kill. As we push on top lane, our enemies come at us. Shadow Dash allows us to focus Poppy for some heavy damage, and then Jax chases her for the kill. However, he's taking so much damage I have to act quickly and use Stand United to keep him alive. He survives long enough to kill Poppy and escapes to the south. Poppy attacks me from the brush as though she were some kind of ninja. So as payment, I flip out and kill her with my teammate Jax. Shadow Dash results in Cassidy in getting very low, and as we chase, my ninja instincts allow me to dodge Ezreal's ultimate. A perfect Shadow Dash gets Cassidy and Ananivia killed, so I teleport home safe and sound. I see that our Cardmaster is in trouble, so I stand united with him allowing him to survive through the initial damage burst. I spam faint to tank for my team, but after some initial fighting, Poppy finally chases down Cardmaster. However, once Diplomatic Immunity wears off, Heimerdinger's turret and I kill her. I regroup with my team to kill Cassidy and Anivia once more, and then a perfect Shadow Dash picks off Ezreal. Here I aim to prove that Shen is in fact more ninja than Evelyn. We see each other in mid, but Evelyn gets scared. She tries to Shadow Walk, but Shen is so ninja he can actually make people leave stealth at whim with Shadow Dash. We're trying to chase our opponents across the map, and because of the energy system, I can use Shadow Dash simply to run across the map faster. The cooldown comes up very quickly, and I use it to ensure we kill Evelyn. 
The whole time I'm also able to spam faint so that I don't die. Thanks for watching the Shen Champion Spotlight. You'll be totally ninja in no time.